So hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for clicking. I really appreciate it. Come on and support wholeheartedly. Just know that I really appreciate your effort. Niggas wanna when it's dark, baby. Skin tone ain't a sky, lady. Niggas spend enough your fire. Still ain't a spy. When it's dark, I feel like this weekend I'll be doing a lot, so why not start? vlogging and i think i want to go to the grocery store and get some ingredients for cake and then later during the day we are gonna be making cake i really hope i'll be able to pull this off because i really enjoy watching like random vlogs of people chilling in their houses and doing like a bunch of things or just running around doing errands so i really hope you enjoy this vlog please give my video Give it a like, like to give it a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. Please keep supporting me whoever you are. So I'm just gonna set you up, Kidogo, as I get ready. I'm almost done. I've just worn my outfit, but I've not yet done like my face. But I'm not gonna stalking. So I want to do the final touches and then we leave. So please watch the video till the end. And again, don't forget to give this video a thumbs. Don't forget like to imagine like uh. yeah. Yeah. pandemic. Pandemic, pedi wangu anasenge hadi Kendrick. Tuko ocha, tunavuta boza, mamuti sami tu karibisha namboka. Ma pantre wana ona ngombe kuku, madembi ringanya na kadudu. Night runner size wezi toka pudu, mturo kwanga tamu. Pick my skin though, guys. Japaka makeup, see Japaka makeup. I only used SPF. So I wanna show you guys my OOTD and then we bounce. But yeah, from top to bottom, I just have a headband that I got from Forever Trendy. I think I thrifted this in toy, if I'm not wrong. And then I'm happy. I have cargo pants. But let me just show you guys. Quarantine, quarantine, quarantine. Woo! I die. Put a letter for extinguisher. Hey, to put an around. Now my terrorists are not a bomb. Pasta nganga, are not a bomb. Jibanjiki, Kenya needs a loan. Alejandro, Van de Mopon. Oh, pandemic. Koroka imeisha, pandemic. Name wako handsome, pandemic. Kuna chadia Samsung, pandemic. Pa, pa, pandemic. Oh, pandemic. Pa, pa. Pandemic, oh, pandemic. I'm at the hub. I came to Kafo. I finished with Kafo. I got all the ingredients I wanted. Then I went to Miniso because I was looking for a spray bottle, but they didn't have the size I wanted. So guys, I just got home. Let me show you guys all the things that I was able to get. The first thing that I bought was cherries. Got cherries in there, and they cost me 200 bob. I got uh, strawberries. I also got whipped cream, but this from Tuskies, because Kafo only had like brands from abroad. And then I got other basic ingredients like cocoa, vegetable oil, chocolate, chocolate milk. Just also got my favorite snack. I got. Uh, but then Kafo doesn't have a lot of local snacks. Anyway, these are my favorite snacks in the whole world. I love chip sticks. They're just like French fries. They're like chipos in Kaushwa. Mm -hmm. I got this Starbucks coffee that I really wanted to try. So I'm going to try it for you guys. But I don't need So not to a fridge And then we'll see how it tingles my taste buds. I literally just woke up. It's the next day. It's Saturday. I thought I'd be doing so much today because I thought I'd go to town. But it's raining, cats and dogs. And I'm not about that life, imagine. I'm not about that life. So anyway, today I'm just coming to give you a taste test for this starbucks coffee <clears throat> and i'm also having it like with the slice of cake we made yesterday i vlogged it on my insta story so i didn't find the need to vlog it in my videos so i want to taste this for you guys and see if it's something that i can buy i love milk so i really don't mind drinking flavored milk i chose the caramel frappuccino it goes for i think 400 but mine is nice and cold and i honestly can't wait I honestly don't know what I was expecting. It's just like daily fresh that tends to private school. And I oh it's nice. I would say it's not nice. It's nice, imagine it really is nice. 
No, it's actually really good. Okay. I'll talk to you. Quarantine, quarantine, quarantine. So I'll just be, I'll just want to set up and do a little bit of work. But since I don't want you guys to watch me doing work, I'll put in a small cut clip of me buying like street food, Kenyan street food that I really like. So on today's episode of social distancing, <laughs> I'm out here looking for Mutura. It's very early in the morning. We've made such a big order because, well, because we can. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so just a reminder for those who don't know what everything is this is called this is called mara this is motura this is a uh, dondero <laughs> then you have nyamachoma yeah so i don't know somewhere along the way i decided to make this a food vlog i don't know i don't know just go with the flow come on now watch go with the flow okay so i wanted to share with you guys my favorite snacks and i've been willing to shoot i've been meaning to shoot for a very long time but this is literally the fifth time I've bought the snacks and I'm not even all of them. Is it as much as they have a video regardless? Me, I love my boy with all my heart. Ooh. I just got this Somali is kind of a junior and buy yourself my boy. You don't have to chill here. Mm. It's so good. Quarantine, quarantine, quarantine. I literally cannot wait for my tongue to be purple. Nourish and David. Make the one who does that. When I have my boo, when I'm eating my boo. So this has chili, so this is my favorite. And also in red, this is the basic, this is a staple. Like everybody in Kenya eats red mahuyo. But it's done, it's really available. <laughs> So the next item that I have is called kashata. So kashata is coconut. I think it's coconut that it's dried coconut that's been dyed. Is it fried? I think it's fried. Oh my god. This is so good. I like how chewy this is. Coconut is not a good flavor for me. But kashata. Let me show you guys the consistency. It looks like um, it's coconut. It's so chill. It is I'm trying my best to carry bear the microphone so that you guys can can hear how chewy it is. I don't like that chewiness, you know. The next item, mini metafuta. Ni metafuta, ni metafuta, ni metafuta. Please, simply stop tafadali tropical heat. Please. I like chepda. I've not met a Kenyan who doesn't like chepda. My favorite brand is definitely tropical heat. I love tropical heat chepda. This one is chili lemon. They have chili lemon and they have the original flavor. The Depuis, the Depuis brand is also not so bad. The only difference between the Depuis one and the tropical heat one. This one is more spicy, it's more seasoned than the tropical heat one. But I also like the tropical air. Uh, this chili this is a mixture of a lot of Kenya snacks that you can buy separately. I don't want to open this because I don't want to eat them now. Oh, and they also come in sugar-free options. I learned recently. I love Del Monte so much. There's the joy of drinking it like EQAV in a juice box with your castrome. I don't know how to grow that. So yeah, I think that's it. These are also Kenyan gummy bears. I love gummy bears, but they didn't have what I wanted. So I just took this. I've never eaten the orange one. I like the mixed one more. But this is also a Kenyan company. I was actually very surprised. I like uh, Kenyan gummies more because I feel like uh, as a majus na kwa has made me artificial flavor, so you can't eat a lot. You can't eat a lot at once. You get because you're scary. You know when 
you eat like curry balls, you just feel it here. You eat like two, three, four, and it's like mm -mm, enough sugar. But this, I can eat a whole packet of this, and I don't feel like me class curry mob. So yeah, these are the few Kenyan snacks that I really like. Then you can keep cooler over and over and over. Let me show you the other things I've been eating. Don't need machines to cooler, and the papers go quite dusty. I was saying it's so embarrassing that I have to come here with empty papers. His cashew nuts, and you realize that I have them in small packets because I don't like buying like the big big. Packets, cause you know once you're like umeshiba, and then now you leave your your, your snacks, they get so good. It's just uh, it's just I can't. So I love cashew nuts. I also love urban bites. I don't know which is your favorite brand of crisps in Kenya, but I can't pick between urban bites and um, and tropical heat the chip sticks. I think I mentioned urban bites. Oh, I was talking about urban bites. I had picked an array of flavors of this. Because I didn't have tropical heat, I prefer tropical heat any day, any day of urban bites. But say in quarantine, everybody's buying snacks, I guess. So I put a snacks for supermarket. There's also this like uh, urban sticks. They are they are corn chips. They are corn sticks. Then they are flavored as well. They have these ones are the sweet chili ones. I really like this one. Then last but not least, this this came into the market very recently. They are called Mr. Corn. They are corn puffs. I love their flavor so much, especially this one. This one is the spicy cheese. There's also the hot ketchup, and it's I swear to you, God, it's delicious. You have to go to the supermarket and get yourself these things. So I guess those are my favorite favorite Kenyan snacks. I hope whatever I mentioned is all Kenyan and nothing is not by a brand. That's not care. Finapa, 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 apa. Please subscribe, please. Tafadali, get 400 subscribers, please, please, please. Okay, thank, bye.